Ashur Turkish or nose pudding is a Turkish dessert porridge that is made of a mixture consisting of grains, fruits, dried fruits and nuts. In Turkey it is made all the year and served especially during Muharram, the first month of the Islamic calendar, as the tenth of Muharram corresponds to the day of Ashur. Ashura means tenth. In Arabic, Ashur is one of the limited set of Turkish desserts which contain no animal products. One reason behind it is arguably protesting all kinds of violence and bloodshed. Alevites in Turkey are the prominent group to promote this pudding, traditionally cooking and sharing it following the days of fasting, coinciding Battle of Karbala, in which they abstain from eating meat. In the Battle of Karbala, Hussein ibn Ali and his followers were murdered. Traditionally, Ashur is made in large quantities to commemorate the Ark. S landing and is distributed to friends, relatives, neighbors, colleagues, classmates, among others, without regard to the recipient's religion or belief system as an offering of peace and love. Ashur was traditionally made and eaten during the colder months of the year as it is calorie-rich fare, but now it is enjoyed year-round. Etymology the word Ashur come from Arabic word Ashura Arabic, Ashra Ashura. It means tenth. In Turkish tradition, this dish is made mostly on tenth of Muharram or after tenth of Muharram in Islamic lunar calendar. Not only Islamic believing, but also pre-Islamic beliefs related with some Semitic stories also connected by Muharram month. Also in Turkish, Ash as represents mixed porridge. It is derived from Persian word Asher. Meaning mixing. Evliya Celebi defines the Ashur in his travel book. Ashur is a porridge as, that should be cooked at the tenth of Muharram. Ingredients Ashur porridge does not have a single recipe, as recipes vary between regions and families. Traditionally, it is said to have at least seven ingredients. Some say at least ten ingredients in keeping with the theme of tenth. While Alevis always use 12. Among these are wheat, rice, beans, chickpeas, sugar, or other sweetener, dried fruits, and nuts, though there are many variants. However, many renditions add orange and lemon peel to add depth to the pudding, sesame seeds, pomegranate kernels, and cinnamon may be used as garnish, and some variations are flavored with rose water. In most cases, it is vegan, and it is one of the well-known and the most popular vegan desserts in Turkish cuisine. History and traditions In anecdotal history, it is claimed that when Noah's Ark came to rest on Mount Ararat, Noah's family celebrated with a special dish. Since their supplies were nearly exhausted, what was left, primarily grains, dried fruits and the like, was cooked together to form a pudding, what is now called Ashur. Turkish families make Ashur pudding to commemorate this event. Ashur is distributed to the poor, as well as to neighbors, friends and relatives. The day of Ashur is an important day in the Muslim year, corresponding to the Mosaic Yom Kippur observed by Jews, and is observed by Muslims world over in honor of the Prophet Moses. The 10th of Muharram day of Ashura also marks the end of the Battle of Karbala and is a special day of observance in Shia Islam. Among Turkish and Balkan Sufis, especially Bektashi, the Ashur pudding is prepared with special prayers for health, healing, safety, success and spiritual nourishment. Ashur represents many cultures' beliefs, Islamic and pre-Islamic alike, and therefore is celebrated to commemorate many spiritual events believed to have happened on this day, for example, it is believed that the Prophet Adam was accepted by God because of his repentance. Noah's Ark came to rest and the passengers survived. The sea was divided, and the nation of Israel was delivered from captivity, while the Pharaoh's army was destroyed. Jesus was raised to the heavens, etc. Martyrdom of Hussein ibn Alith Armenian version is called Anusabor. Armenians serve it during Christmas and on New Year. S. Eve. Like a shore it may be garnished with pomegranate seeds and flavored with rose water, and the pudding is shared with neighbors during the Christmas season. The festive pudding is the centerpiece of the New Year's table, which is often decorated with dried fruits, nuts and pomegranates. Popular culture 
Literature Turkish author Elif Safik has scenes involving a shore in the Fleet Palace and the Bastard of Istanbul. In the Fleet Palace Safik writes, As they boiled there on the stove, all the ingredients prattled on in unison but each in its own language. And in the Bastard of Istanbul Mustafa recalls childhood memories of eating the bowls of dessert he had been entrusted to distribute to his neighbors. References External links Annual Nose Pudding Day